Hello everybody, I am back with my second unboxing. This is a little bit different though. This is the Bookish Box by Appraising Pages. And I found them on Instagram. This is pretty cool. The only reason that I subscribed for this month though was because it was Harry Potter. And Harry Potter is my favorite, as everybody knows. So, I'm gonna open this up. The bookish box is not a book box. It is a box filled with bookish goodies. So it's a little bit different in that respect. And it's pretty cool. So we open it up and we can see um, this card that says Harry Potter and then it has a list of the things on it, but I don't really wanna look at that quite yet. So, open it up. Oops. And that is what we see. Let's see this, this crinkly paper. So I'm going to check out the t-shirt first because I know for a fact that these always come with t-shirts. Cool. So this is the shirt. I'm not sure if I'm getting it in the frame. But it says, words are, words are our most inexhaustible source of magic. Albus Dumbledore. So this is pretty cool. Um, and then here in the bottom... Cool. So we have a watercolor print. Let's see. By Lexi Olivia? Lexi Oliva, maybe? Um, it says Expecto Patronum, and it's gorgeous. It's beautiful. Can't wait to put it up. We have sort of Starbucks mock up Hogwarts coffee. Um, Tumblr by Not Nirvana. That's clever. And then inside it, there were a couple of things. Oh, Butterbeer bath salts, which is why this box smells like butterscotch, which is awesome. And now I just need like a bathtub. Oh, it smells so good. We have this little container. from Rich Love Shop. There's the card. And then inside, the stories we live best live in us forever. That's what this necklace says. Oh, it's so cute. So, as this is the first time that I have had um anything come from the bookish box i'm pretty impressed it was harry potter so i knew that i was gonna love it like hands down um but it's pretty cool and you get a lot for what you paid for it um i can't remember exactly how much it was i don't think it was over 30 dollars. i'll put the links um in the down bar but we got a shirt butterbeer butterbeer salt scrub or bath salts it's a salt scrub but I feel like that's a different thing. I don't know. It's bath salts, a watercolor print, um, the tumbler, and a necklace. Um, so that seems like a lot for that. Um, and I'm fairly certain that... Um, so appraising, oh, appraising Pages does the t-shirts, and I'm fairly certain that the t-shirts are only for the boxes. So you can't buy them anywhere else. So that is pretty cool. Um, it makes them more unique. So, yeah, I would give this 10 out of 10 um, as far as rating the box goes. And I just might have to subscribe for more than the one month. So, like I said, I'll put um, links in the down bar. Nicole and I are reading um, two books, actually, by Sarah J. Moss. She is reading A Court of Thorns and Roses because I have already read it and I am reading the second which just came out which is A Court of Mist and Fury um, and so it will be her first time stepping into the world so she'll be reading the first book and I'll be reading the second and if you haven't read the first you should check out hers and if you have read the first but not the second you should check out mine and those will be up um, relatively shortly along with Nicole's review of The Queen of the Tearling which is um, a lot better than mine so <laughs> I will talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.